everyone. I'm Gina from the Children's Museum of Green Bay and today we're going to play with paper. We're going to make a paper lantern. Really simple and a fun way to decorate your home. So for this you are going to need construction paper, some uh, glue, a scissors, and if you wanted to have stickers, markers, uh, other pieces of construction paper for embellishments and to decorate, you can do that as well. All right, let's get started. We're gonna start by taking a piece of construction paper and folding it the long way. Okay, just like that. Then you're gonna take your scissors and you're gonna cut some little slits on the folded side, but not all the way through, all right? Uh, maybe about a half an inch or so, just like so, all the way to the end, just like that. All right, so you see how it's still some space at the bottom. I didn't cut it all the way through. All right, then you're going to open it up and... We're gonna be folding it the opposite way, but for now, I'm just gonna put it down to the side. I'm gonna take another piece of paper. I'd like to have a different color. It's up to you if you wanna do this part, um, but I'm gonna take it and I'm gonna cut three little strips of that color, okay? Just like that. I'm actually gonna want it to be a border, as you can see on this one. So if you want to kind of measure and see how much uh, paper you need so that it's not going over your cut piece, you can do that. And then um, the top and the bottom is probably the same, so you can kind of measure it to cut the other one. Okay. Put my two strips here. One more strip. This strip is going to be the handle. So I'm gonna make this one a little bit wider. Just like that, probably double the size. All right, let's put this together. Now I'm gonna take this cut piece of paper and like I said, I'm gonna like roll it around the opposite way like this. All right, that's the way it's gonna go. And then since it's already kind of folded there, makes a cool paper lantern, all right? Before I do glue it though, I probably should put these strips on, right? I forgot about these. So let's take those skinny strips that we just cut out and glue them on. If we do that after we roll it and glue it, it's gonna be hard to do. So I'm gonna glue one strip right at the top the top being where my lines are going down, right? And then one at the bottom. At this point, if you wanted to put any more decorations on this, you could. You could add stickers, you could draw with a marker, um, you could cut some other pieces of construction paper. I cut out some stars so I'm going to put some stars and I'm just going to put them um, probably on the border here. Maybe I'll put a couple uh, throughout it as well. Uh, paper lanterns are a great party decoration. And with all of the patriotic celebrations in summertime, it's fun sometimes to do them in red, white, and blue. Okay, so there's my bottom line. My stars are yellow, so it's not exactly like the flag, but I'm kind of trying to make this one patriotic. Mm, but if you wanted to write words or use stickers, you could do that as well. And uh, if you make a bunch of them, you could string them and have a whole line of paper lanterns as decoration. Okay, there's my line 
of top and bottom. Do you think I should, maybe I should put a couple in the middle. Should we do that? I'll just do a few. I don't have that many left anyway. All righty, I'll put them in between where the other ones were. <clears throat> All right, well, one more. Excellent, finished with that part, with the decorating. There's my finished lantern. Okay, now let's make it into a lantern. So we're going to roll it like so, okay? And I'm gonna just put some glue on the end of one of the sides. If you wanted to, you could also use a stapler for this step instead of glue or tape, if you feel that holds it better. I'm gonna push it down and really make sure it holds down. Okay. Here we go. And now I like to push it down a little so that it really, you can really see those different slits like that. Okay, and so now we have our handle, right? Okay, I'm actually gonna trim this a little bit skinnier. It's a little wide. And we're just gonna add our handle onto it. Again, I'm gonna use glue, but you could use tape or stapler if you wish. And there is my finished lantern. There you go. Here's my other one. And like I said, you could make a bunch of them and put them on a string and hang them to have a really fun decoration. If you make one, we'd love to see it. Please post it in our comment section. Play well, learn well, and be well, everyone. We'll see you next time. Bye.